everyone. It's me, Darlene. It is Monday. I am sitting in front of, guess, can you guess? Shaw's. I've already been in the store. I took my camera in, recorded just a couple things. Very boring, so I don't even know if you'll see those clips or not. I never know what will last through the editing. It's me, the store. I just want to show you the reduced meat section. It's packed, but oddly enough, I find that the deals are not always that great. So I'm going to look and see. I mix this. Hmm, do they have two of these? It's the sweet one, though. Not bad, two grams of carbs. And uh, one gram of sugar. If it was two, they will go, and I would get three dollars off. I'm gonna look. I need both hands to look. Okay, I thought I'd do my shopping first before asking for the flyer. And I went out back, and they said the flyer must be up front. So I'm headed there. But I forgot that it's a uh, one dollar whoopie pie day all week for Mainers. So I need to get some whoopie pies for my mother, and I'm gonna put them in the freezer for her. I got her Italian for a dollar off, and then I got this is going to be five bucks off, and uh, it's ten something. Yeah. There's people, people right next to me. Okay, so I'm going to pay only five dollars and twenty cents after the coupons, and it is. Uh, I put my glasses on. Almost two and three quarter pounds. So pretty good deal. It is nice out. It is, I think it was 36 degrees. I'm obviously not wearing my sweatshirt. It is like summer. Really, if summer could be 36 degrees, I think I would be in heaven. I want to say a big shout out to Barbara. Hi, Barbara. She knows me from the blog and we chatted for a little bit. So I just love running into people. But then on the other hand, I'm always afraid they're going to say, are you Darlene? And I say yes. And they'll say, I watch you cry. Nobody's said that yet, but it's probably in the back of their minds. And I'm in a good mood today. I woke up in a fairly good mood and, um, the flyer was super easy to get. I happened to go out back first and saw Jim, and he says, nope, they're already up front. So I went up front and went to the service desk, and they handed the flyer to me. So let's look at it really quick, and then I'll show you what I got. Okay, main version. Ooh, pork tenderloin. I just bought one and reduced. I'll show it to you. 188 a pound. What else we got? Orlando Lakes American cheese. Nah. Oreos. Some other stuff. Let's see if we have any special sales here. Da -de -da -de -da. Huh? Oh my goodness. They have a page where they're including my mix savings. So you can see it's like $4.99 minus a dollar my mix, $3.99. That's gonna get a lot of people confused. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. All right, nothing jumping out at me. But I will um, show you what I got. I did remember that today, well, I didn't remember. I looked at the flyer as I walked in the door. And it's whoopie pie week for us Mainers. We have 10 for 10, so a buck a piece. And I got my mother five. I'm going to take them out of these containers, just wrap them up, throw them in the freezer. I got her two regular whoopie pies. In my mother's world, this is the only whoopie pie. Chocolate cake with the white cream. So I got her two of those. She might be mad that I didn't get her just five of those, but then I also got her two strawberry ones. I was thinking that, nay, I don't know, maybe it'll taste like a, what do you call it, uh, like a jelly roll or something. So I bought her two of those, and then I got her one with the uh, white cake and the chocolate cream. Now, even a buck a piece for these is kind of out of my range because I usually get her all kinds of cheap stuff in reduced bakery. But I thought for a change, I would get her those and I'm going to make her try not regular whoopie pies. I picked up a family pack of chicken thighs, 88 cents a pound. So I paid $5.57 for this baby. Very good deal, over six pounds, almost six and a half pounds. Got a rebag as I go so I don't have to bag it all when I get home. Then in reduced bakery, I got 
two loaves of white bread, only 50 cents each. Sometimes I get them for 35, but they were 50. So I got two, one for my mother, one for the squirrels. And then I got her some English muffins, their whole wheat. My mother is a white bread kind of girl, but she's gonna get the whole wheat English muffins, and these were also 50 cents. Last but not least, Oh, it's not last. I got this tenderloin, and now that I see they're going to be $1.88 next week, but I don't have any pork right now in my freezer, so I'm going to uh, cut this up. It was originally $5.99 a pound. It's on sale for $3.88 a pound, so this baby was $10.20. I had a $3 off and a $2 off, so I got $5 off, so I paid $5.20 for this tenderloin, and it is... 2.63 pounds. So that's not horrible, and but you know, there's no bones, no fat, so I'm paying for just meat, and I'm just gonna cut that up, freeze it. Now, one more thing. My mother's Italian sandwich. $3.99, I had a dollar off, $2.99. So she is going to have an Italian sandwich for lunch, a whoopie pie for dessert, so her lunch is set. Oh, you know what? You know what I want to do? I watch a lot of YouTube. I think you probably know that by now. But I watch a lot of, like, videos made by 20-somethings, and they're all just, you know, very nice, petite, beautiful girls. And they do makeup videos and style videos, and they do things like, what's in my purse or what's in my makeup bag? And I thought, what a riot if I were to do that. A 55-year-old woman showing you what's in my purse... I'm telling you, it's not going to be the same things that the 20-year-olds have in their purse. They have, like, all kinds of expensive makeup and different products, like, you know, some nice perfume or spray or whatever. And I have things like maybe gum wrappers and <laughs> you know, a lot of old receipts. So I was thinking maybe I would do a what's in my purse video. Might be funny. I don't even know what's in my purse so we could find out together so give this video a thumbs up if you want me to do a what's in my purse video and um and i can clean my purse at the same time my one dollar purse that i got at the thrift store probably like two years ago at least a year ago see how i don't spend money i'm fogging up the car the windshield is quite foggy i could like write my name in it seems like there was some other stuff i wanted to tell you oh yeah so the online deals by darlene page my facebook page start checking that out derek is posting for me again on that and uh shauna has started posting on that so i'm super excited about those things i have started posting again i usually die out on that page for January because after Christmas it's like nobody you know wants to be shopping for things a week after Christmas now we're getting to February pretty soon so it's time to start posting online deals so you guys can stock up on things for birthdays and you know a lot of people have gift stockpiles you just stock up when things are on sale and you have gifts for birthdays anniversaries weddings even Christmas you can start shopping for Christmas now I give you permission to do that all right let's go home I'll talk to you soon Bye.